Hello and welcome to yet another Let's Play on Total War Shogun 2. I know, it's crazy. I'm fully back now, aren't I? It's great. I'm going to do another Let's Play with the usual mods, nothing crazy. I do want to get into some, uh, some more specialized mods, I guess, soon. I want to redo my Portugal campaign at some point. Uh, that's a pretty big overhaul mod, if you will, for one faction, I guess, but still. I also want to just get into some actual overhaul mods at some point. I know people always mention Master of Strategy and stuff like that. I usually say, eh, I don't really like Extended Japan, and all those mods tend to use Extended Japan. It just makes the campaign last so fucking long. But I, I know a lot of people want to see it, so I will get into that in the not-too-distant future. But now I want to do one more one more regular old campaign. I just want to start another campaign. I'm going to play my... I want to say my bread and butter, but that's not necessarily true. I want to play as a Shimazu, though. It's uh, It's been a while since I've played the Shimazu. The last time I played the Shimazu, I think I did a, um, a Katana-only challenge, which wasn't really a challenge, because Katana Samurai... Katana Samurai-only challenge. But yeah, Katana Samurai aren't really a bad unit or anything. I mean, I did a Yari Samurai... Uh, only challenge as well with the Date, which also wasn't very difficult because Yari Samurai, as crap as they are, you know, if you have 19 of them in a general, you'll be fine. Uh, but this is just going to be a regular campaign. Um, so no challenge, just, you know, while well, playing on Legendary, but that's not really a challenge, is it? Um, but yeah, plays uh, plays a Shimazu. The first ever clan I played on the channel... Actually, that's not true. I think I played the Date before I did. But the first ever Legendary campaign I did on, on the channel was with the Shimazu. Um, so yeah, definitely... Probably the most basic clan out there, everyone knows the Shimazu. I think a lot of people will start off playing as either the Shimazu or the Jusukabe when they do their first campaign, so... Maybe you see this as a bit of a tutorial campaign, I guess? Anyway, let's, um, let's get into it. So yeah, all the mods I'm using are in the description. Again, it's the same as the ones for the Takeda campaign, which I'm doing right now as well. Uh, there's no mods that change gameplay in any way. They're all mods that um, only change visual stuff. Obviously the camera mod, the... Larger font mod because I'm playing at 1440p. Um, the mods that make the units look a little bit better, the ca the campaign map looks a little bit better. I'm not going to watch the cutscene because I've seen that a million we times. Are the 1545, single uh, Well, what we can listen to, of course, is our favorite geisha intro. If, if our daimyo is to, is to become, become shogun, shogun military ruler of all, all Japan. Japan. All right, enough of that. God, never gonna get old. I don't know if you guys have seen the, um, someone actually went through all my intros and actually made a compilation of all my, if our daimyo is to become Shogun. And they gave it, they sent that to me on Discord and I was like, fucking, that's amazing. I uploaded it a couple months ago on YouTube. If you haven't seen that yet, if I remember, I'll put it in the description. It's a, it's a, it's a beautiful video. It's basically two and a half minutes of me going, if our daimyo is to become Shogun, military ruler of all Japan. Anyway. Uh, right, so yeah, Shimazu, we uh, starting off at War of the Ito, own two towns, Osumi and Hyuga. Uh, we, of course, start in Satsuma with a lovely blacksmith, one of the best starting positions, and with the ability to recruit Shimazu Katana Samurai, of course, upgraded Katana Samurai, so we have Shimazu. Um, fucking brilliant, basically, just start off recruiting Samurai immediately, and just fucking go ham. Like I said, I did a, a Shimazu katana samurai only challenge and it was just a breeze because katana samurai alone 19 of them with a general fuck yeah sign me up but then you've got them buffed from being shimazu and the fact that you start off with a blacksmith right away plus one melee attack plus one armor immediately i mean yep i'll uh i'll have that anyway um we let's have a look at uh, our clan management we have two generals we have our daimyo and uh, Tanegashima Tomokata, who I'm sure people are going to be like, oh, that guy is super famous for doing this, that, and that. Uh, but I, I don't know. I think he actually, Tanegashima does sound like a familiar name. I think this guy is probably famous for doing something. We have a 12-year-old son, a 10-year-old son, and an 8-year-old son. Beautiful. That's going to be great. Um, right, well, I think... Uh, oh, right, yes, we want to upgrade this immediately. I almost forgot about that. Yeah, playing as a Shimazu, we want to try and capture all the trade nets immediately. Man, it's been a while since I've played in the West. Actually, no, it hasn't. One of the last campaigns I did was that very high uh, taxes challenge with the Otomo, which I have yet to continue or restart. Um, anyway, I, I would actually like to recruit some Katanas immediately, but I think I'm going to hold off because I want to make sure I upgrade the farm as well. That means I can't recruit a single unit, though. That's not right. I can't do that. I could upgrade the roads, but that's not really all that exciting either, is it? Um, 
One thing that's always annoyed me in this game is that for when we play as the Takeda, we start off with instead of a um, I think you actually yeah, you, you lose a Yari Ashigaru, but you gain a light cav. Why the fuck don't we lose a Yari Samurai and start off with a Katana Samurai when we're playing as the damn Shimazu? Come on, man, what's up with that, CA? Get your game fixed. Anyway, um, oh, that's tempting. That that's mighty tempting. Okay, well, first of all, let me see if I can get any money from trade. Uh, no, is the answer to that question. I haven't met anyone yet, and we're already trading with the one clan we can trade with. Giving us war horses, of course. Very nice. Uh, right, well, let's get the daimyo into the army. And then we're just going to go on the offensive, I think. Uh, I do know that taking uh, Osumi immediately is actually a little bit difficult. Because they, I think they have a fairly sizable army here. But I think we'll just siege him out and then just let him attack me, basically. I'm not going to do the actual siege, I'll tell you that much for nothing. Uh, anyway, do I have anything else to do? I feel like this is a very short term, but then again, it's the first turn of a campaign. It's always going to be pretty short, isn't it? Um, yeah, I mean, the, the, the only question is, do we want to recruit a Katana Samurai or whatever to recruit two units? Like, I, It's not like I can actually build anything else anyway, so I think I might as well. Um, like, just two Katana Samurai early on with upgrades, and the fact that they're Shimazu. Yeah, it's gonna be fucking brilliant. I think that's good. Uh, let's move up a tiny bit. Right, so... Yeah, there you go. There's that other army. Hmm. Oh, they start with Light Camp. What the fuck? Alright, so I'm actually, I'm actually a little bit tempted to fight this one. If they didn't have an Archer in there, I would 100% do it. But annoyingly... Oh, this is kind of funny, actually. I wonder... No, no, no. I was gonna say, they could just, like, um... I have a... Of course I've got my bubble, so they can't run around me. But if they could, they could just run to Satsuma and just grab it. And then the campaign finishes right there and then. Uh, if I paid more attention, I, prob I probably could have just attacked this army instead. That would have been better. Um, right, so if I... Okay, so if I were to do the siege... Let's have a look here. So, th this is all reinforcement, so... I probably should fight it. I could probably grab it in a single turn. We basically try and set up where this army is likely coming from. We kill these four units and then we just besiege the town like we normally would. I don't like sieges, and it'd be weird for my first battle to be a fucking siege in a new campaign, I mean. But I think I'm gonna do it. So they're gonna come from, like, the... well, the northeast on the map. If that's gonna work out the way I think it... well, the way it should. But otherwise they're coming from my, like, left. So I think we're gonna be coming from here. And then they should be coming from here. If it if it sets up the way it should do. Which I imagine it will. It'll probably set us up around this side anyway. And then the enemy will come from around here. So we'll just set up like as close to the castle as possible so we can run and catch up. The light calf might actually be able to get inside the castle and there's not gonna be much I can do about it. That is that looks very foggy for dry, but alright. I don't want your damn speech. See, here's the problem. We're set up over here. Now why is that? Because the water we should we need to look at it like this, right? Because the water is to the south. Which means the enemy should be coming from here. Because that's where they attacked me from. Or that's where they were reinforcing from. I'm pretty sure we actually got sallied out upon. And our army should be here. But it's not. So I'm gonna... Oh god, this this could go horribly wrong. If this doesn't work out the way it, sh it should, this is actually gonna be real fucked. Uh, let's actually spread out quite a bit, because that's okay. Uh, archer unit, and then our two generals. Let's spread them out as well, actually. They should come from around here somewhere, but yeah, if they don't, if they just end up coming from over there, we might not really enjoy this battle. Oh, please. Show me. Fuck. I fucking knew it as well. I actually fucking knew it. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna run the generals over. It's dangerous at the light cap, but so be it. I'm gonna run everyone. I can't believe it. <laughs> Why would they come from the exact opposite side of where they're supposed to come from? Like, if you looked at it from the way we were set up, yes, this would have made more sense. But the fucking sea isn't to the north, it's to the south. Which means they can't be on that side, because that's where my castle is. That's where Satsuma should be. Son of a bitch, I got fucking ruined. My army's going to be all split up. This is not going to be a pretty battle anyway now. But that's okay. 
This is why I don't fucking... No, this is not why I don't fight offensive sieges. I don't fight offensive sieges because they suck. Not because of this reason, specifically. Hopefully they are walking. It means I'll be tired when we face them, but... Oh well. I haven't seen... Oh, here we go. There's the light calf. Right, the light... But oh, they're charging me. That's good. The, the light calf will beat me one-on-one. -on -one. A two-on-one, -on -one I could probably... Oh, I could take him, but I don't really want to. Um, because I'd still lose a lot of men. So I'm gonna just lure them back and wait for my units to get in range. This GRS guard will mess them up, so let's run them over here. We're just gonna slowly start walking back. I need to make sure I catch the other units as well, but even though they're probably running, we should be able to catch up. Alright, so I need to, we need to cross paths, like, at the exact, at the right time. Oh, are they, they're actually sending them after my archers now, right, that's smart. Uh, let's have you guys sprint for a bit. So yeah, I saw some, I think I saw some of the units back there. Oh god. I'm gonna let myself get charged to not be- actually put him in yard wall. Bomb! Perfect timing. I lost one general man. Alright, that's fine. Actually, you know what? Keep running this way. You are gonna just charge in there. It's all my units, right? That's pathetic. Alright, there are some units right there. If I can't catch them before they get inside, this would be really bad. Okay, we fuck them up, generals. I need you guys to uh, start running over there. See if we can distract them. There's gonna be at least an archer over there as well. If we can kill the archer, that'd be great too. It's still this is this will still be really annoying. Uh, whoever's in Yarival, stop it. Fucking run! We're all gonna be so tired. Where the fuck are you going? How did I tell them to go that way? God damn it! What a waste of movement. Okay, the archer's all the way by itself. Well, that's good. So we can wipe out the archer, no problem. But I'm still going to try and lure these guys over. Their archer's on this side, so they shouldn't be able to shoot me unless I get too close, which it looks like I'm doing with this unit here. And once they see the generals nearby, hopefully they'll be like, Oh, look, it's a general. Let's go chase him. Yep, like that. I'll just make him run back towards the uh, towards their archers. Actually, no, not necessarily. No, just towards my men. I don't want that unit to... Ugh, I don't want to charge head-on, one-on-one, to be honest. I'm being shot now, this is not good. I really wish that unit would come over as well, but I guess we can't have it all. Let's go over here. I really don't want to get shot, this would be a real waste. You guys are going to kill the general. Fuck me, my, my men are just as tired as theirs are. This unit we can remove the tiredness at least with, once that ability resets. God, what was that? Yeah, yeah! Come on, we need to at least tag him. Okay, you're joking me, they're gonna go towards the fucking... I can't believe I didn't tag them. Okay, there we go, an archer, right? Let's just have you run towards them. You're gonna get shot, but then we can charge them back, we'll be okay. They are actually gonna get away, so we got one... Oh god, that's... that means both our Yari and Shigaru are gonna be on the walls. Oh, that's rough. Wait, if I run you guys both behind this unit, they might run towards them. Ah, oh, get in there! Yes! Perfect, okay, that's, that's good. really don't want two Yari Ashigaru inside the castle, right? So they're fucked off. If I could wipe them, that'd be great. Oh my god, my units are gonna be so tired, but... Are they running outside? No, they're not. Uh, generals, get in the back of this unit as well, please. Right, and you've done your job for now, let's just line you up. I think they're charging the back of these, route them real quick. Get the fuck out of here, there we go. Just touch them will be enough. Did we wipe that archer unit? No. Alright, let's actually kill a couple more of those. I want to kill as much as possible here. I know how said it! Alright, cool. So, all we've got is one archer unit. Can hopefully be avoided. Are they shooting at me? They certainly are. Okay, well you've killed... Yeah, that's 11. Yeah, if they survive, it's okay. More experience for me, am I right? In fact, I should definitely make sure some of them do survive. Uh, you've done enough as well, actually. Alright, so let's go over here. Let's just walk over there. Hey, I'm walking here. 21. Actually, yeah, I do want them to survive. The problem is they could run away towards their other town, which wouldn't be bad. Oh! I wonder if they killed any of their own troops. I don't think they did, but that would have been... That volley completely missed me and just demolished them. Alright, uh, I don't know if we need an- I don't find enough of these battles to know. I don't know if I need an archer here 
to keep them occupied. If I don't, actually, I mean, if I move the entire army here and they just stay there, then yeah, we just fucking start shooting until we run out of ammo. So yeah, we'll start with that. Uh, let's... Should I attack from two sides? Probably not. Maybe I'll keep you there. Let's triple speed this either way, because this is going to take fucking ages otherwise. Don't shoot. You son of a bitch, if you shoot at me, I swear to god I'm coming in there and I'm killing you. Not that I wouldn't do that anyway, but you know. Right, so if I put you guys over here, we might even be able to shoot at that archer in the back. Although I prefer shooting at the Arya Shigaru, because they're a much easier target. You guys are going to bust open this gate, which means we are going to have to repair it. But that's okay. I'd rather do that than have to climb and take a lot of losses. Alright, there goes the gate. Yeah, just fucking wipe the floor with them if you wouldn't mind. I'll use up all my ammo before I go in there. There's no reason not to. You guys aren't even tired anymore. You're fresh, in fact. Holy fuck. They're still tired, so I guess they're running around more than I am because I'm tired and winded. I don't really want to fire at them. That's not... Well, I mean, they're the only units that can really do anything against me as well, to be fair. And they're going to fight to the death, so... Yeah, killing them would certainly help, actually. Although, using all my ammo to do so. Let's shoot at that unit. Nope, let's not, because they're moving around. Let's just wait here and do nothing. Well, how about that? Take them off fire at will. I could go inside, but yeah, it would just be losing men for no reason. Maybe I will just shoot at these units, unless they're coming over here. Boom, boom, boom. They are. Okay. Uh, you might want to take a safer path, actually. Like that. Oh god, fire! Please fire at them, yes. Perfect. Ugh, why'd you have to go and move? Why'd you have to go and make things so complicated? There we go. Those are the kind of volleys I want to see. Is this really the fastest you can fire? You, you just... Oh, I think they just can't fire from here. You're joking me. You fucking... You have me on! Alright, fire at that unit. If I can wipe them out, that'd be fine as well. Or just do as much damage as possible. Alright, you guys have arrived. They don't seem to care, still. Um, Right, I'm as good as out of ammo. I think that might have been... I've got one more volley, or half a volley left. I'm gonna run you guys inside. Everyone's fresh, perfect. They're still tired as well, which is even better. Even better. All right, I'm gonna sacrifice the Yari Samurai because I don't give a fuck about them. I'll probably discard them after this battle anyway. Ah! Don't shoot at me, though. What the fuck? I didn't expect that. All right. Uh, generals, let's have you guys come inside as well. Okay, they're all wavering. And shit. I'm not even gonna go into Yari. Well. No point. Yari Samurai are dying. What a beautiful sight. So yeah, they can't route, of course, so we need to... Actually, we can capture the point. That's not a bad idea. Should have thought about that sooner. This is just losing men on men that I don't need to lose, so I need to be careful here. Oh fuck, now they're chasing me, son of a bitch. They go for my general here. Oh god, the timer. It's almost done. Haha, fuck you. Alright, we lost, uh... Yeah, we lost a decent amount of men. I'm definitely gonna remove the Yari Sam, so they're... that's not a problem. They're gonna get replaced by the far superior Katana Sam. Mazukatana Sam, in fact. Good stuff. Hey guys, you got another siege battle out of me. How about that? Must have been quite quite a sight to behold. You can see that every day, do you? I think that's uh that's three siege battles in a, in a week from me. Oh, although one of them to be fair was just like a single katana or um samurai retaining unit that I wanted to wipe out. So I didn't throw a the castle. But other than that, two actual sieges. One the Takeda campaign, one this campaign. What the fuck's happened to Donkey? He's starting to like him. Right, everyone pulled their weight. This unit, a little bit more than the rest. General, absolute piece of crap. Right, they did survive. Uh, and this was... Oh, this was still my first turn, of course. I didn't even think about that. Alright, we got our call to arms so I can recruit more shit. Great. Can I reach them? Yeah, I can, the general. Now, let me see if this bar's still busted. Yeah, it is. All right, so I'm going to have, once again, a campaign where I can't see the realm divide meter because it's broken for some reason on my game. I don't know why, but there you go. 
Uh, okay, here's the thing. Do I now... No, I'd have to be the Katana Sam. I'd have to cancel. I was going to say, do I cancel the Katana Samurai and build a building? But... I haven't even started to, um, a mastery yet, by the way. I'm going to go for Wave of Chi. <laughs> I'm going to go for Bushido, because otherwise, how can I recruit my Katana Samurai? Oh, wait. Um, yeah, Wave of Chi, I think. Why do I go for that first? Plus one morale better. No, because I go for Toto Fukin right away. That's why. Now I get it. Alright. Um, I do think building a building is... Ugh, I can even upgrade the harbor again. So I can start recruiting even more ships in two turns. That's pretty good, to be honest. I can grab... If I can grab three of these... If I can grab four of them, would be great. But that's unrealistic. If I can grab all three of these, that'd be great. The silk, incense, and incense. Uh, yeah, I, f I think that's that's probably the right way to go. Let's not, let's not recruit another unit. I'll just recruit one, one good old Yari Ashigaru. Now the town is incredibly unhappy, but it's going to be fine next turn. I am, however, uh, I'm going to definitely try and murder this army. I would like to go back into my own town if possible, though. I'm not sure if I'll be able to. Probably not, which means I won't get any replenishment. But it's okay, I guess. I'm not losing that many troops. Can you even get there? Oh, you son of a bitch, I can't even get there. You're joking me. You're having me on! This guy can, though. Not as good, because it means I don't level up, but... It's alright. Right, now this guy is awfully trapped here by himself. <laughs> not a huge fan, I've got to, I've got to admit. Uh, but I'm at least in reinforcement range of myself, so that's okay. You're gonna, still gonna die. I mean, there might be an army over here, but I mean, I can't imagine I can't dispute it with these four or five units. Goodbye, Yari Samurai. Now, for those of you new to the channel, you're wondering why I did that. It's because Yari Samurai are kind of naff, and they cost a hundred and... what was it? It's the same as this guy. Actually, no, it's, it's more than this guy. These are 153. They would have been 160-something, probably. I mean, you could just look back. Just go back 20 seconds into the video and you'll see, alright? Um, but yeah, they're just kind of shit. Do you want to peace out? No, I don't think you can peace out your, like, first clan that you're at war with, can you? Uh, right, so we've done our... Well, there's no diplomacy to be done. We've done our Master of the Arts. We have taken the town. Great. I don't know if we're going to go on the offensive towards Hugo right away. Guess we'll see if, if anything pops up. Um, spent all my money. Yeah, I think we're just going to... Gonna move on, to be honest. Let's go. Be great if the Ito actually just came out with another army, Yari. but they didn't. Yari Ashigaru is the best unit in the game for their cost. You should use many of them, especially if you are playing as the Oda. All right, Master Way of the Sword, and we get a Katana Samurai, which is uh, really annoying because you get him without upgrades. So we get, we built this, or we get up to this tech. And we get a unit that's worse than this one, because I don't have the upgrades. Really annoying. Minus seven. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the actual fuck? Okay, alright. I guess I have to sit back. There's no way I can keep this place happy, even with this unit in there. It'll be minus six. If I recruit a unit... Uh, I guess I could, actually, if I exempt it. I exempt it. Then it's minus two. Next turn it'll be minus one. If I recruit one unit, it'll be zero. So I could go on the offensive with this stack. But it's not much of a stack, is it? I don't think I will. Plus, I don't really want to exempt right now. I'm, I'm actually trying to make some money. So, yeah, let's not. Let's get back in Osumi for now. It's still minus one, but it'll gain that happiness at the end of the, or the beginning of next turn. So that's fine. Um, okay, so what do we want to do next? I guess we'd want to build a building, which would be a sake den here. Which will leave me enough money to recruit two more units, which is not a bad idea. Can I recruit both of these? No, I can't. Right, well, in that case, uh, I don't get any bonus, of course, on my Ashigaru, because it's that upgrade. You need to upgrade it first, and then I'll give it to Ashigaru. Um, so it doesn't matter where I recruit them, is my point. I think... I would like another Yari Ashigaru, or two. 
Wait, why can Oh, call to arms. I was gonna say, why the fuck can I recruit two units here? That's baller. Alright, so I think with that, I probably will go on the offensive. That will give me enough. Enough! Still can't do anything because I've not met anyone. I want to now change your commission to development, please. And yeah, both of these guys are now... Oh, which means I should cancel this building. Look at this. We're on 39. Or oh, rebuilding it? 56. All right. Because we, uh, we got the development commission now. Um... What was I saying, though? Uh, I was definitely going to mention something after I did this. Oh, right, yes. Uh, that they're both on basically 10, or 13, and 11 yeah, experience now. Um, cool. I think that's it. Let's move on. Next turn we can start building some ships, so we'll need the money for that. I just need, I just need free ships, basically. I can't make trade ships yet, but I need, to, I need free ships to just occupy those points. Alright, Toto Fuken some good old upkeep production. Sounds good. Trade endeavors. Construct a trade construct a trading port even. We got a thousand buccarinos for that. Not bad. How much money does that cost? 1764. 1764. Sengo Kuchidai. Um yeah we uh, we obviously can't afford that right now. Could cancel the sake then. I guess I don't need it for happiness, but it would certainly help. It would mean that I don't have to yeah, yeah, it's annoying, to be honest. Definitely doing that, so that would leave me... So if I if I were to cancel this, it would be enough money. Because it's... Actually, how much is it? It costs 850, but we have discounts. I think we, we would have enough money to build one. It would take four turns, though. If I don't do it now, I guess I could do it next turn, unless I want to... Like, I want to keep building other buildings, but building the trade port is definitely important. It's going to make me more money soon, so yeah, I think I'm going to cancel this. I'll have to exempt this place from tax then, instead. Or leave a bunch of units behind, but I'm not interested in that. Unless, can I get there in two turns? No, I can't, so I'd have to suffer a turn of attrition. So I could alternatively wait two more turns, in which case, oh, Sumi won't be unhappy. But I'm also not recruiting any more units, which means that I'm not getting any stronger. And they are. So, I'm just gonna take the attrition. Let's fucking go! We're not gonna take attrition yet, of course, but we will do soon. Uh, yeah, sorry. Oh, great clan destroyed. Oh, oh, I wonder if it's the Tokugawa. Oh, it was. What a fucking surprise. Okay, uh, so yeah, we cancel the sake then. And then we build up a trading port, and I'll do it here. And so, four turns, we get a thousand bucks back. Uh, what else? So, minus six. Okay, so this is going to be minus five next turn. Then the turn after that is going to be minus four, plus exemption will make it zero. So that'll be fine. Alright. And we got some ships coming in next turn as well. Just to grab those points. I'll grab. I'll probably just go for this one and that one and leave this one till later. No one else is going to grab this, I think. And then the, ne the turn after that, I'll grab that. Grab that all on the floor, grab that. Because I want to be ambitious. Uh, anyway, is that all? You can master Saruman. I think it is. Feels weird, man, not upgrading this building. Um, yeah, I don't think there's much else to do here. Let's get a fucking move on. Actually, no, I haven't, I've still not met anyone, have I? Nope. All right. Let's go. Let's see if the Ito run into me. No, they didn't. Already passed their turn. Fast, moving. Fast as fuck, moment. boy. Alright. Let's assume he's unhappy. So, minus five, next turn, minus four, plus exemption is okay. Right. Let's have you... Because you could probably grab this one in... No, actually, you might be just shy. Let's just go towards that one. Let's be ambitious. So, that one's not been grabbed yet, so you're going to go for that one. And then I need one more ship to go grab this point, which is still empty for now as well. I might make two, just on the off chance that I can grab this one here as well. And if not, we just have a slightly, or, you know, stronger navy. I could always get rid of it again if I really wanted to, if I need the money or something. Right, so we are going to take attrition here. Ooh, you have an army too. Alright, so that's currently as strong as mine. 
and they've I've got attrition to come unless they attack me and they probably will recruit another two units or something so they'll have the advantage but that's okay that's what I thrive on uh, I can upgrade or I can build a sake then now which will definitely help with so I don't have to exempt this anymore after this I think we should be okay I might need to recruit one unit or something yeah I think we'll go for that um, yep I think that's all looking good to be honest. Let's keep going. Toto, fuck you, and I probably want to build the or go for Zen soon as well. All right, if you could attack me before I take attrition, that'd be fucking lovely. Thank you very much. It's very kind of you. They did recruit more units. They have I have eight. They have eleven. Fucking hell. It's pretty baller, my guy. Uh, okay. Also, the uh, Otomo, I think, just murdered Sagara. Not great. Don't see that very often, I'm pretty sure. It means I'm bordering them. I'm gonna be bordering them on two fronts after I take uh, you guys while I get some load in. Um, please give me a force that heal. Uh, God, if, I, if only I start on their side. My God, that's beautiful. I might try and run for the hills. <laughs> get it? Um, no, but yeah, I. Um, yeah. I'm bordering the Atomo now, which is not great. I imagine their army is fairly sizable too, and we don't have anything in our capital, so they could very easily come in. Well, actually, if they did that, I'll attack them in the back. I don't want your speech. Right, this hill's pretty lovely, but they have massive archer advantage, so I really don't want to go into a shootout. If I set up here... ...and run to this hill... This is a great hill. <laughs> Slaps hill. This is one fine hill. Um, I just hope that I can get there before they do, because obviously they're closer to it, but they'll probably set up like in the middle or something. They are attacking me, so they will come towards me. So yeah, this will probably be kind of awkward, but just the fact that we have the hill is going to help us a ton, so... I'm still going to try and go for it. Let's just actually get as close as possible here. Min-max the fuck out of this. Archer, why are you so far back? Get up there. Alright. Oh, they're really far away. That's beautiful. Oh, that's... That's beautiful, that is. I'm gonna run there. Oh, it means I'll get tired, but I just want to make sure I get there on time. Because that's the most important thing right now. The foremost important thing in this here battle... Um, yeah, the hill part is not even that important, but it's actually not bad at all. It's the... Uh, actually, keep running. It's the forest on top of the hill. That is absolutely fucking amazing. Two generals as well. Alright, we are in position. Let's walk you guys now. Oh, I thought we were corner camping for a second there. I thought it was the, uh, the edge, but no, it's a little bit further out. They could still, still try and shoot at me. But all they can see will be my general, so I'm gonna move them as far back as possible. I might not even want to fire back with this shit, I'll probably just take them off fire at will. Wait until they're like right here, and that's when we like when we discover them. Okay, they're pretty wide actually. I might need to go a little bit wider myself on the left side there. Maybe go a little bit like that. Yeah, we don't want to... We basically, we don't want them to see where we are. So we're going to just uh, not fire at them until we can see them. And then hopefully they'll just straight up charge into me. If not, we'll charge downhill in the Ari Wall, which should be okay. They do have two generals against my two generals, so we don't have any advantage there. So it's going to be difficult for me to go around and flank them. But they have two more archers than me. And they have three more units in total, so that means they have one more Yari Ashigaru than me. Um, but we, like, so as long as we can fight them in Yariwal downhill, like, it's gonna be completely pissed -taken. But the question is, will they give me that option? I think this unit's too far out. Oh, far out! Hidden units, my lord. Oh, fuck me, they're here already. Okay, they've spotted me. They still haven't started- well, you may as well fire them at that point. Fire! There we go. Alright, so I'm gonna pop my Yari wall if they 
do charge me. Currently, this looks like they're trying to run past me, but... Alright, Yari Wall boys. Beautiful timing. Alright, I'm actually gonna line you guys up more straight. Be fucking gay, boys. Uh, generals, you are now no longer needed back there. No, don't run away, you fucking bastards. You can't... See, this is what I was afraid of. If they just do that... Uh, it's uh, kind of shitty, but it's okay. I'll run into them instead. I want you to inspire this unit. Oh, Our general them. is in grave danger, so my lord. This one. Our general is in grave danger, my lord. All right. Luckily, they're all shooting at my Boshigar, which is great, and the force is helping a ton. You fucking rallied your men. I shall do the same. How dare you? All right, I'm gonna see if I can get a rear charge in there. Actually, let's keep you nearby just in case morale drops a bit too low. Lou, if I can route just one unit here, that'd be fantastic. Can, uh, start routing all the way down the line, basically. Just charge from here, and boom goes the dynamite. And then that one should go as well. There you go. And now, actually, I think they might be walking into me, so that's okay. No, they're not. They're just lining up right there. Perfect. Okay. Just walk on into them. Uh, I'm half tempted to charge into this unit out of the area wall. No, this is fine. Was he just going for my general? I have no idea. Let's get you around the other side now. We'll get you in the middle. Do a bit of a rally. No, we still got the rally going, actually. There's no need for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Oh, it's promising to be a beautiful battle, my friends. A fantastic wi win? Victory is what I was going to say. It's a, more, it's a nicer word, isn't it? A fantastic victory. Oh, they've all routed. God damn it, I didn't even get the charge. Son of a bitch. You died too quickly, how dare you? Alright, let's get out of Yari Walls. Charge in there. Charge! I want to kill as much as possible. Preferably not everything but as much as possible. I don't want him to run into the town. I'm actually, I'm not gonna bother even attacking this shit over here anymore. Uh, I might wanna try and kill the general though, that'd be helpful. Oh fuck, they're running. Running, running, in, running. I don't see the actual general himself. There he is, right there. Get him! Get this guy right here, get him, yes! I trapped him. Fuck him up. Come on, kill him. Don't let him get away, son of a bitch. Come on, don't... You're running past him, you stupid idiots. Yes, the Yaris are in there. Fuck him up! Don't let him run! Son of a bitch. Alright, I need to watch some other shit as well. Are you killing this? Alright. Uh, yeah, keep, keep doing that. Don't tell me he ran away, please. Where's he at? I'm not gonna look for his corpse. Where's the units? There, eight men remaining. I'm gonna have to fucking count. Uh, three, five. There was one right there who just died. Six men remaining. Oh, please tell me. Okay, wait, was that? That was. So there's only. Okay, the general's dead. Basically, that's what I'm trying to say. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's keep wiping the floor. I actually wouldn't mind if everything dies. I don't need the ten experience anymore because we're gonna level up anyway. Although it wouldn't be bad if I could get my second guy up to level two. Well, actually, no. I could do that for just attacking the town. But it looks like there's probably going to be some stuff that gets away here. Keep it up, my general man. You're generally amazing. Alright. Let's just triple speed this for a bit. Come on, do your best, man. Half of you aren't fucking engaged in this unit. You stupid idiots. Still 92 bows as well. I would actually like to kill the bows. Because they're annoying in a town. Alright, so that got away, so yeah, that, that unit will certainly have gotten away, but that's okay. They're probably going to run into the town as well, so it's actually, I definitely would have preferred if everything died, but it's okay. I think our general over there probably killed up that entire unit. Alright, that was very clean, I like it. That's, uh, 12, yeah, they're probably gone. Heroic victory, always good. Hopefully that will give me a, uh, an extra honor as well. That will certainly help the happiness around these here parts. 
Actually, no, it won't. I only get plus one happiness when I get the five honor, and then six honor, you get plus two. But still, it's good. It's always a positive thing, that's for sure. All right, very clean. Lots of experience all around. Good sh uh, job, except for you guys. You fucking sucked. But then again, I couldn't blame you. You're firing into a forest. Okay, that's a lot more surviving than I was hoping for. I'm not even sure if I'll be able to auto resolve this now. Hopefully. But we've still got that attrition to suffer as well. You will suffer me. All right, so there goes the Sagara. Uh, now we're boarding the Atomo, as we discussed. That is indeed a pretty sizable army. Fucking hell. Uh, they still own their two starting towns, Bungo and Buzen. Hey, Atomo, how about some trade? I definitely want to be your friend. Oh, God. I will listen as politeness dictates. Right. As to the response you receive, that depends um, on what you offer. What about if I gave... I just, I'm not going to do this, but what if I gave you my son? What I gave you my eldest son? My heir? No? Alright, I don't think there's... I don't even know if there's actually a, a, a difference in that. I'll have the town, please. Thank you very much. I'm not gonna make them a vassal, I'll tell you. We are fucking broke, holy shit. Right, you keep going here. I think it's over here, actually. Oh no, it's right there. Still available. Right, you're gonna grab that, or not. I don't think anyone else can grab this, so yeah, let's have you go towards that one there. And then you should be able to grab that without anyone else getting in there. You can go grab this one. Haha! Haha! Tono? Uh, oh fuck, I messed up. I was gonna attack this with the uh, second general, so he would have leveled up as well. I'm such a cunt! What an idiot! Anyway. Uh, that's meh. Ooh, that's pretty good. Plus 10 accuracy for all bow infantry under this man's command. D certainly a lot better than plus 1 morale for this general and his bodyguard. No art. Well, that's what we have one archer right now, so there is. It, it does something, but not a lot. Alright, we took a bunch of damage. We. The Sagara died, and then also the Igto died. We encountered the Atomo as well as the Shoni now. And the Equi Kinatori at War. That's. Nothing new there. Uh, I have... Oh, right, of course, no, I was gonna say. This is weird. Last turn, there were two clans I knew. The Ito and the Sagara. Now I, there's two clans I know. It's the Atome and the Shoni. Because my entire diplomacy list is just different clans now. It's kind of funny. Um, Alright, in fact, I think... Uh, if I can still grab that next turn, you're gonna grab that, and you're gonna go that way. But we'll check on that next turn. Right. Uh, so I can't recruit anything in, in Huga. I can't build anything in Huga. This place is unhappy. If they decide to declare war on me, we have a bit of a problem here, to be honest. I'm gonna start pumping out some Yari Ashigara to build a bit of a force here. Their army is wounded, but if they start heading down here, they'll have at least one, maybe two turns of replenishment. How unhappy are you? Um, we're gonna... Oh god, we got non-climb religion as well. Son of a bitch. So it's actually only going to be... It's going to be exactly zero next turn with uh, eight units in there. So if I move out, just, like, it's completely fucked. Absolutely, completely fucked. I cannot recruit any more units. And I can't trade, so I just really not much I can do here. Wait, were you guys at war? Did I see that right? Yes, you are at war. Well, Shoni, if you could just um, help out, please. I guess that might mean these guys will go this way instead, which would be helpful. If they do, I might certainly consider attacking them. I don't want to expand too fast, because the whole clan might religion and the fact that our towns are just incredibly unhappy. If I had leveled this guy up, that would have been great, because then that means that if I take any other towns, we don't get as much um, resistance to invaders, if he's the one leading the army. So I definitely fucked that up, but it's okay. Um... We're, okay, one turn away from Toto Fukan, so I'll increase my income a little bit. And then I think I might go Zen before I go Bushido. Because I really need some happiness around the place. Alright, end of turn. Atomo, what are you going to do? Don't do it. Good, they didn't do it. I don't know what they did do, but they didn't attack me. And that's good. Alright, Toto Fukan, let's go Zen. Gone. 
GT Quartermaster's report. I was talking so highly of recruiting Katana Samurai immediately, and I have yet to recruit one. I mean, I queued up one of them at one point, and then I stopped queuing him up. Right, I can grab that one too, so let's have you go here. Am I gonna take attrition here? It says no, so I guess not. If you take attrition, I'm gonna fucking kill you. I'll, s I'll sink you, I swear to god. Alright, so we have three of them at least. Now, we're one turn away from that, so I'll be able to start making trade ships and then our income will fly up. Because right now, it's a, f it's atrocious, to be honest. It's absolutely horrendous. I need to build a socket in here for happiness, which once again means I can't recruit any units. That's <laughs> a fucking disgrace. Um, I don't think I'm going to attack them until they attack me. I'm tempted to send General back. But... Uh, uh, if they attack me, I'll send them back. Not not yet. Anyway, um, I think it's time to end this here turn. Perhaps the episode. Let's see what happens. No cliffhangers to leave it on. The Shoni have actually taken one of the Otomo towns, I just realized. That may have been lost turn, I'm not, I'm not sure, I didn't check. Hey, I forgot about that, we get a thousand bucks back. That's why we build it so quickly as well. I don't even get one trade ship return, but it's going to certainly help a lot. I can almost recruit or build the second one as well. Not quite. We've lost another great plan, and it's not going to be the Otomo. Normally, at this point, I would guess Otomo or Shimazu, but I know for a fact it's neither one of those. So, who could it be? Let's consider this for a second. It's not going to be the Takeda. It's probably not the Oda. It's likely not the Hojo. It could be that Tori. It's usually not the Mori, although it could be. It's not going to be a Chosukabe, and the Date is unlikely. I'd, I'd say it's either that Tori or the Mori. I'm going to say a Tori. It's the Mori, for son of a bitch. But I got close. That's the that, that's same fucking thing happened in the, uh, in the Takeda this? campaign. I got it wrong as well on that oh. one by saying it's, it's going to be one of these two. I'm guessing this one, and it was the other one. Anyway, uh, I'm going to end the episode there. I don't know what's going to happen. The Shoni have taken Buzan, which is good for us, because as long as they're fighting, it means they're not fighting me. And I don't really, I'm not really in a rush, because I'm about to start making a bunch of money. Whereas right now I'm making very little money, and I could certainly do with some money. So I don't, yeah, like I can't really even recruit many units because my income is just so terrible right now. So I, I want to make some money, hence I don't want to necessarily expand right now. So, have I had this exempted this whole time? I have. See, that's kind of where my money problems have come in. Oh boy, that's... How many turns has that been? I think it might have been three turns too many. Well, what turn are we on? Turn six or something. Seven. Yeah, I think I've probably had that exempted for three turns. It's so it's so happy as well. What a waste. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna do one more turn because I might forget about that next time, and that would be real bad. So let's do one more turn. No, the Atoma managed to take this one, and they've actually got a trade ship too, maybe even two. Okay, um, well that's incredibly annoying. Fuck you, Atomo guy. I want to recruit more units. I also really need to build some buildings to get my income up. This is probably, yeah, shit soil. It's the official name. Uh, let's just get a couple more Yar. Yes, you guys, do one over here as well. And then I think I will actually send this general back. That feels right. I kind of want to. He should have been leveled up by now. I messed up on that in that regard, but it's okay. If anything, I'm sending him back to go pick up these units and bring them that way. Like, he's first and foremost going here in case they declare war on me, but. If not, I can just send them this way and join in. I don't really want to have two armies already, especially since I can barely afford one. Uh, anyway, right, so we're just going to have this ship sit here, because if I do kill off the Otomo, or someone else kills off the Otomo, this will come available. I can just grab it. I'm just going to sit right there. I'm like, nah, don't worry about me. I'm not attacking you. Actually, no, I shouldn't. I'll, um... I did that as a joke. I should sit just outside of their range, so if I do declare war on them... Um... I'm not stuck inside their zone of control. Well, I, I mean, I guess I could attack them and then run away, but that would just voice movement. Anyway, uh, I think that's that. You don't want to trade yet? Then you die soon. Not yet. Alright. End the turn. Still not declaring war on me. They haven't taken anything either. This unarmed ship. Unarmed ship. 
cool. All right, so our income is no longer... Well, it's still pretty crap, actually. Let's not let's not kid ourselves. Our income is absolutely atrocious, but it's not as bad as when I had a town exempted for far too long. I'm sure people would comment about that. That's going to be great for episode number one. Hey, guys, you should see this as a bit of a tutorial and then me just not playing this well at all. Good stuff. Um, plus the, the mistake of not leveling up this guy when I could have... Oh, he's loyal as fuck already, though. Holy shit. Uh, did, I guess we did gain one from the heroic victory. Yeah, great victory plus one. Beautiful. Cool. Well, that'll be that. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I will go through these, actually. Next time, we're going to just probably take the rest of Kyushu. Well, maybe not all of it, but we're going to continue doing so. Until then, have a good day. Um, tell me not to make any more mistakes in the comments, and goodbye. <laughs>